Hi everyone, welcome back to Apple Quick Fix. Here we are going to see some simple troubleshooting tips to fix iPhone not receiving text messages after iOS 26 update. First fix is refresh airplane mode. First enable airplane mode. Then go back to the home screen and force close apps. Then disable airplane mode. Now check if your iPhone receives text messages. Second fix is hard reset your iPhone. Here we have only three simple steps to force restart the iPhone. Do the following steps one by one quickly. First press and release the volume up button. Then press and release the volume down button. Then hold down the side button until you see the Apple logo. Third fix is enable iMessage and check the phone number for send and receive. First get into the messages menu. Here enable iMessage. If it is already enabled, disable it and then enable it. Now check if the problem is fixed. If the problem still continues, click on send and receive under iMessage. Then select the phone number and mail id correctly to receive messages. Fourth fix is enable data roaming. First open the settings app. Next tap on cellular and make sure that cellular data is turned on. Then tap on cellular data options. Here turn on data roaming and check if the problem is resolved. Fifth fix is Refresh send as text message and MMS messaging. First move into the messages menu. Then scroll down and turn off send as text message and MMS messaging. Wait for a few seconds and then turn them on. Now check if your iPhone is receiving text messages. Sixth fix is reset network settings. First launch the settings app. Next tap on general. Then scroll down all the way to transfer or reset iPhone and tap on it. After that tap on reset. Here, select Reset Network Settings and enter the passcode to confirm. Now select Reset Network Settings from the pop-up menu to confirm and wait until your iPhone turns off and turns on. Now check if your iPhone is receiving text messages. And the final fix is Reset All Settings. As we all know, Reset all settings won't delete any data from your iPhone, but it will reset all your iPhone settings to default. Try the following solutions one by one and check if the problem is fixed. If you know any other solutions to solve this issue, let me know in the comments.